Guys, something has happened and I'm in a shock. To be honest, I'm so shocked. So today's day three of our new island life and I was like, okay, it's going to be a good day. We're gonna be running around the island. Tom Nook was like, you know what? We need more residents on this island. Can you set up these little plots? So we done did all that. We went around, we were crafting some furniture. We got our cute little house plots all done and ready to go. And then I went to talk to Tom Nook. He gave us some fence. It was all good. Then I ran outside of the resident service tent. And guess what I found out? All our plots have been sold. Oh my goodness. I don't know if this is like a new thing or if I messed something up. I have no idea what happened here. But all the three of the new plots have been auto-filled. Look at that. I went on mystery islands as well. Or I went to one island and obviously there is no one on the island. So all our plots have been auto-filled. I'm so shocked. I am so shocked. This is crazy. I don't know what happened. Someone tell me in the comments down below if this is a new thing or if I messed something up. I don't know if I was supposed to go on Mystery Islands before I went to talk to Tom Nook, but I'm pretty sure this was not in the game when I was playing it in April. I am so shocked. So guys, welcome to our first villager hunt, which is out of filling our plots. What is this? I'm so shocked. This was not in the game in April. I'm sure I went and like villager hunt all my first villagers. So stay tuned. I'm not gonna reveal who is moving in. We're gonna go on a little time travel trip and we're gonna see who moves in. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Are you guys ready for our first villager? <laughs> oh my goodness. Hello everyone. This is Tom Nook. Now for today's news. <laughs> I'm like, I'm so giggly because I'm like, I can't believe that just happened. I <laughs> like, I completely messed that up. But <laughs> here we are. Our first villager hunt of our first island or our new island is... Who is it going to be? Cinnamilla gained a new neighbor today. It is Drago. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's stop by and say hi to Drago. Where is he actually? Oh, I think the first plot was somewhere up there. Okay, oh my goodness. <laughs> this is Drago's home. He is our first <laughs> villager to move in. <laughs> Oh my god, I can't believe it. I can't believe that just happened. Oh, what is up, Drago? I mean, Drago is kind of cool. Nice to meet you, I'm Drago. I just moved here today all on my own. Uh, I can't play yet because I gotta unpack my snacks and my other stuff like furniture and stuff. But come say hi tomorrow. Okay, Drago was our autofill roulette contestant number one. I mean, he's not too bad. He's not too bad. He's actually kind of cute. I'm not mad at that at all, but oh my goodness, you guys, I did not expect this to happen, actually. Like, oh, and you know what? Oh, this just reminded me of something. So the autofill void is kind of a mystery to all of us. We don't really know how it works exactly, but I suppose like I don't have Nintendo online on this account, so I haven't played with anyone else. So there cannot be anyone in my move out queue from like friends islands or anything but i think sorry i'm just looking for a bottle right now but i think that um someone from our move out queue from my other island could possibly be here because i have visited myself from my northern hemisphere island on this island to drop off like some stuff so I'm kind of scared now. There is only two villagers, but they went to the void very, very long time ago. And they were my nemesis Cheddar and Biff. So there is like a slight chance that they could move into our, our island. I'm not sure if that will happen. 
Because they went to the void a very, very long time ago and I'm not sure. I don't know if you need online membership to actually have like friends, villagers moving to your island. But anyways, Drago was our number one villager of this crazy autofill roulette. So let's see who is going to be the next one. Okay, guys, villager number two. Here we go. <laughs> Fingers crossed. I swear if this is cheddar, I'm gonna be so upset. Now for today's news. Cinnamilla gained a new neighbor. It's Patty. Patty the cow. I think Patty is a cow, right? <laughs> okay, we have Patty on our island. She's our second autofill roulette villager. Oh my god, let's go say hi to Patty. What is happening, you guys? What is happening? Oh my goodness, it's not cheddar. It's not cheddar. We can be happy. I'm I'm happy as long as it's not cheddar, honestly. I don't care about anything else. Where is Patty's house? Was Patty the one? Oh, that is her house. Oh my goodness. Patty's house. Okay, I said Patty's house way too many times. I'm kind of in a shock, guys. So it, like my, my brain makes no sense right now. I'm <laughs> like, what is happening? Oh, it's Patty. Okay. Okay. Hi, Patty. Hi, I just moved here. My name is Patty. You're Mila, right? Ah, <laughs> uh, but when I'm done, you should totes come over. Oh my goodness, you guys. Say hi to Patty. I mean, okay, Patty is not the worst. <laughs> she is okay. She's okay. Not a villager that I would pick up. Definitely not from a mystery island, but kind of kind of shocked right now. Okay. Her house kind of matches a little bit to the to the orange theme that is going on with Frida's home. Let's go say hi to Mabel real quick. So maybe we can have Abel sisters really soon on our island here. But oh my goodness, you guys, I can't believe. I don't know what is happening here. Ooh, this is cute. Definitely gonna buy that. That, this is crazy, you guys. This is absolutely crazy. Like, I have no words. I have no words. But let's go and check who is going to be our villager number three. That is going to be our last autofill roulette villager. Okay, guys, are we ready for this? It is our last villager of this mess of an autofill roulette. Now for today's news. Who is it going to be? Oh my goodness, I'm closing my eyes. Who is it? Who is it? Dora. Dora? Who is Dora? Oh my goodness, I don't even know what Dora looks like. <laughs> Cinnamilla is becoming a rather bustling place. Yes, yes. Oh my goodness. Oh, honestly. Oh my goodness. Okay, yeah, we've been like time hopping a few days here. I mean, we are probably going to go back to the to the date that we were, but you know, kind of like speeding through these first days because this is a hot mess. Um, hello. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. We do crazy things like this here, apparently. Let's go say hi to Dora and see who Dora even is. Who is Dora? I don't know. Where is the the last plot let me think where was it mm, okay yeah yeah yeah. okay now i remember let's go say hi to dora Ooh, that house is looking so cute oh i really like this design of the house okay let's go and see who dora is is it a chicken <gasps> no it's a mouse oh my goodness ah, i hate the mouse villagers so much <gasps> Oh my goodness. <laughs> my name's Dora. Oh god, I hate Dora already. Okay, to be fair, if I would not really hate the mouse villagers, Dora is kind of a generic looking mouse, so... But no, the mouses, they are not for me. Or the mice villagers, they are not for me. What is up, Patty? Welcome to, welcome to the island, I suppose. So that kind of happened. I have nothing to say. That was super interesting. Just a heads up, you guys. If you start a new island, don't be silly like me and don't autofill your plots like this. Unless if you want to play the autofill roulette like we've been doing here. I cannot believe that just happened you guys we have three new villagers that we did not 
choose. Um, Dora is definitely the worst of the worst. I'm sorry for any Dora fans out there, but I'm not a big fan of the Mice Villagers. They have a special place in my hate box and I cannot stand them. But I'm not too mad, honestly, because I'm not super mad about this. And you probably are thinking like, why are you so chill about this? But I have some amiibo cards, so I'm not too mad at our three autofills. I mean, Drago is pretty cool. Like, he is really cute, but none of these villagers are probably going to stay because they are not the ones that I was thinking for this island. I have, like, a plan for the theme of Sinamila here, and none of these villagers really fit. But one thing that I'm actually kind of happy about, and I probably spoke about this, like, somewhere in the, in the past, but as you all know at this point probably, all your five first villagers will have like that very generic starter home. So the interior of their houses is kind of ugly. So I'm actually really happy that we didn't get any dreamies for these first houses because now we are kind of okay letting them go in the future. So that is kind of what we're working with here. That was kind of a shock regardless. What do you guys think of our autofills? This is insane this is insane but that happened oh, that's so funny that is so funny like i'm just laughing because that is just something that i do like i'm so clumsy of course i should have like gone on some mystery islands before i completed that plot quest oh my goodness i'm in a shock i'm in a shock what could i say welcome drago pat and dora patty this was completely my fault as i said i kind of googled and i saw like some people were like oh i remember that you were supposed to go on the mystery islands like on your first day and i was like what i don't remember anything <laughs> I hope you enjoyed today's autofill roulette. That was like our untraditional villager hunt, it seems. Okay, so for the next part of our new island let's play here, we are going to finally go on a proper villager hunt. Oh my goodness, you guys, what was this? Ah! I want to scream, but this was so funny. Oh my god, I need to get over it. Anyways, tune in for next part when we are going to go on a real villager hunt. And wish me luck. I hope we can kick out these villagers as soon as possible. I mean, Dora is the first one to go. The minute we unlock campsite, you know it. We're gonna be replacing her with an amiibo card because I'm not looking at no mice villagers on my island ever. Ew, that was like the worst villager. And I, because... Honestly, I hate the mouse villagers, so I did not even know that Dora is a mouse. Should have known, though. Should have known. I thought it was a chicken. I would have been okay with a chicken. Anyways, you guys, thanks for watching this hot mess of an autofill roulette. And I hope to see you all in the next one. Bye, guys!